Do you know what? I'm, 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 I cannot read anymore. I physically can't do it. There's loads of viewers here. They can ask you questions, and I'll put them to you. This ain't no. I, I, I've, I've physically, I've done. We've done loads of things, things before, but this guy is just wild. He's just disgusting. Guys, I can't please take start it. sharing. Dave Cox. Um, where are George, we? In George Fuchs Pine Fields. What area? Wensfield. We're in Wensfield. Guys, start sharing. Wolverhampton. How old are you, man? What am I showing you? What am I showing you, Mr. Cox? A picture. A picture of what? Young lad. A young lad. You say he's a young lad. Does that lad look a day over 12 to you? No. What does this make you, Dave? Come on, I want to hear it out of your mouth. Or, and another thing, do you want to call the police or should we? No, it's sad. What's sad? I'm sad. You're sad? Do you think we should call the police on you? Or do you think we should let you go? What What do you think is the appropriate thing to do with you? I think it's just best to walk away with me, all this. Really? I, I beg your pardon? So you... Well, you know, I mean, I haven't actually done anything, have I really? You... Oh. Right. <laughs> you know what, I'm going to keep my car. I'm, I'm, a, I'm so a talking on, you What's this all about anyway? I mean, it, it, it I will tell you what life. it's all about. Let me let me explain to you very, very carefully what it's all about. You ain't been speaking to no 12-year-old decoy. You've been speaking to us. We're a paedophile hunting crew. We're called Internet Interceptors. And we catch scumbags like you and keep them, get them off our streets and away from our kids. You being so asinine and so ridiculous enough to think that we are going to let you go is beyond belief beyond belief um, because the only reason why you're sad is that you have been caught if this was a real 12 year old that you had done on the net you would have done everything and more don't shake your head don't do anything you have come don't tell me you're not gonna you wasn't because you were at the meeting point and then when you saw us and when we stung you oh god penny dropped a bit what you've you done sorry go on Go on, sorry, what no, no, you've no. done under the Sexual Offences Act is you've arranged and facilitated a commi commission of a child sex offence, uh, causing and enticing a child under 13 to engage in a sexual act, causing a child to watch a sexual act, um, meeting a child following sexual grooming. It doesn't need to be a child, it can be a decoy. Um, abuse of your position of trust and administrating a substance with intent. And another one, smoking legislation of 2007, environmental health, seven, seven counts on you I've got. And you, st and you still believe that we should let you, me and my colleagues here should let you go? Oh sorry, my colleagues and I should let you go? Eight counts, the revenge porn. Guys, please start sharing. Shall I tell you what they do with revenge porn now? It's two years, max two years in prison. What they do is... You see, the thing is, if it was your first offence, which I don't think it is, because I think there's a lot more to you... Have you been arrested know. before? No. Never. No. I yeah. really doubt that. Have you ever been with any children? But this, this will all come out. No, I've not been with them at all. Shit. What? Who, who are them people there? Do you want to start moving down here? Start moving down there, get them away. Start moving down there. <laughs> And I come. See, I know we've got to look after you, David. I don't want no one to harm you whatsoever. I want you to go to prison and let justice be served on what you've done and what you could have done to a child. Regardless on the fact that you said that it wasn't a real child, you still groomed what you believe to be a child. Stand here, you're right, Dad. Right. Let's pick this. Sit down, come sit down, mate. There's a car over there. David, don't worry, nothing's going to happen to you. The police are on their way. 
How are you feeling right now? David? I've got no comment to make. Are you upset? David? Tell me how you're feeling. Do you know how this could have made a child feel? What you've done? You've ruined your whole life for the sake of sleeping with your child. You were going to go back to your child's house and have anal sex with him. Who's, who's, to, who's to say that you weren't, though? Like? Yeah, but tell me why. Who's to say that you w wasn't going to do that? How do you know you wouldn't have done that? I wouldn't have done that any road. But why? Tell me why you wouldn't have done that. Yeah, just like one to sit and just talk to somebody, you know, just have a chat. It's all at once. Was you his carer before you was his partner? Yes. Wow. Yeah. We're taking back to the bench. His legs started going. Take a seat. Huh? Yeah, 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 yeah. You got alcohol in the car. David. You got alcohol in your car. Up there. Someone go up there. Safe. Have you got alcohol in your car? Yes. You have. What alcohol have you got? Budweiser's. Budweiser's. Yeah. How many? Twelve. Who are they for? Me. You. Yeah. Not for the child. No. Wow, we are getting swarmed from every angle now. how much danger you put everyone in. Here, get them and them away up there, look. Tell, just pull her back. Go and stand right over there, David. Go and stand right over there. Look how much trouble you've caused. I suppose we're going away as well. Sorry? I suppose we're going away abroad. Where, when was your minute we're going abroad? Two weeks. Where was your minute we going? Mercia. Spain. Andy! Oh my god. Just go and stand over there. Don't worry. Just stand there. I've done it already, I've done it ages ago. How long was you going away for? Seven days. It's all been booked and everything. Sorry? It's all been booked and paid for. Is that all you're concerned about, is your holiday? I'm concerned about me partner at the moment. You're concerned about your partner? Yeah. Why, why are your thoughts not turning to the child that you could have met today? That you would have supplied alcohol with? I believe you have got poppers on you. I do believe that you have got poppers on you. Have you got poppers in your man bag? No. Do you want to show me? I'm, you know, I'm not asking to search you, but if you have got them, I'd like to see them. Just out of curiosity, I know you've got them in your man bag. I know you've got a bottle of poppers in there. Sorry. Wow. So you did bring them. Guys, start sharing, please. If anyone is local, please don't come down. Go 
guys please stop coming down there there are loads of crowds around us now we've got people coming in from different angles where's don't go stay here All you people are concerned about is yourselves. All you're doing now is standing there worried about whether you're gonna get hurt or nothing. My team members have left me so that these people around us don't assault you. Where's get him away, that guy there. But you're not concerned about what you could have done to a child, have you? You're not concerned about that. David. People want to kill you. People actually really want to hurt you. You're scared, aren't you? How do you think a child would have felt? Really? Yeah. We need to get him. I know. And we, need we need to, to pull him off. Now. I want to apologise to all the people on that bench. I didn't know it was a commemorative bench. I apologise. We did not know. So we apologise. We're really but sorry we really, about that. We need to move really, really him now. What is wrong with Oh, it's, oh, it's her. Put the phone down. Tell us to put the phone down. She can come and help with security. No, you're going to stay there, David. No one's going to hurt you. Don't try and run from me because I've got five security guards behind me. That will stop you. I've got supporters down here now helping me, trying to get people away from you. Look at the vulnerable situation you put yourself in, let alone a child. What have you got to say for yourself? David, wake up. You're sorry. I'm, I'm bored with sorry. I want to hear something better than sorry. I need to hear something better. You could have hurt a child. No, I wasn't. You was going to anally have sex with a child. Sorry? It's got the pop on him as well. What's happening now? What's happening now? We're waiting for the police. I bet you can't wait to get in their car, can you? I bet you absolutely cannot wait. Who's going to sniff those poppers? Would you have let the child sniff them? Because you already said that you let, uh, you know people that sniff poppers that are 18. Young people, that was what you actually said. If he had said, can I have a sniff, would you have let him? No, why wouldn't you have let him do it? Tell me, why are you nearly crying, David? David. Why are you nearly crying? Sorry? People around me are scared me. Don't be scared. Some people in this live feed would say that you should be scared because you, you made a child scared. You would have made a child scared. It's terrifying, isn't it? Being scared, not knowing what to do being out your comfort zone. That's how children feel when they get abused. I really hope you go to prison for a long time for this. I really do.
guys, please start sharing. Dave Cox. It is how long they take, Lucy. Very long. Guys, can you please stop saying what park we're in, please? Have you seen how many people have come? I've had to warn them all. Yeah, 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 yeah totally, yeah. I just want to reiterate again um, the bench that we put him on before we did not know it was a commemorative bench if you see where we came into the park there was a load of swings and there was um, there was there was kids playing on the swings I didn't want this man and what well, sorry not I we didn't want this man anywhere near the swings anywhere near the kids we had to move him <laughs> to the bench we didn't realize that it was a commemorative bench to someone I apologize in whoever's person's name that is I really 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 I'm sorry we didn't realize it and if we had it done, I would never, we would never have done it. So I apologise a million times over. You know what I mean? What are you thinking, Dave? What are you thinking? Penny's dropped a bit, isn't it? It's dropped tenfold. over there them boys are my size it's gonna take me and a lot more to keep them lot off you but don't worry we will i will because i have to because all i want to do and my colleague says this on a lot of other people but with you especially all i want is to see you sorry we will see you at trial and i will see you we will see you rather getting cuffed at trial with a sentence on your ass going down you need to you need to be castrated this is not about us being famous and all that crap it is about getting people off the street like you people like you off our streets and away from our children these guys these guys want to weigh you in i i really a lot of people want to weigh you in i want justice we want justice. That's all we want is justice and we want the legislation to change as well. Stop giving you sexual harm prevention orders, giving you community payback, making you go on courses. You people you need life. Sick. You have to spend the rest of your life in prison because you are a danger to the community. You are a danger. Whose flat is it that you live in? Yours or your partner's? So you bought the house? No, we're on board, so we're renting. You're renting. Have you got any family? Yes. What have you got? Brothers, sisters? Three brothers. Have you got any children? Yeah. How many children have you got? One. What is it? A boy or a girl? Boy. How old is he? 23 now. You make me sick. Wow. You absolutely make me sick. You have a you have a child of 23 years old and you've gone for some you've started talking to someone 11 years below the age of your own child you have to be insane you have to be sectioned it's not an illness sorry it's not an illness you have it isn't an illness i hear this time and time again with you fucking nonsense illness this illness that oh it was my first time oh, i wasn't going to do it bullshit it was your first time your have first time going for a 12 year old are you, are you insane have you are got you a sexual insane? attraction uh, attraction to children no. what did you find sexually attractive about this what you believe to be a child because you said you wanted to lick his anus that's what you said though crude and it's disgusting to say but that is what you said what would you have licked his anus no you lying piece of shit you absolute lying right, piece of shit all right calm all down right, calm, down. calm down i'm flipping i'm not calm because i have to keep these away from you what i really want to do is let them weigh you in but i can't 
and you're telling me to calm down. How dare you? How dare you? You should be ashamed of yourself about telling me to calm down. 200 miles, 30 quid in diesel I've waited, uh, I've wasted to come up here to get you. It's not, not wasted, wasted actually. Yeah. It's actually not wasted, I apologize, not wasted. Because I got you. I got to be for everyone that walks past. So we got to be cautious for everyone that walks past. Gosh, wow. This place is taking ages. Oh, here comes another one. What? By the alcohol this morning. Bro, he was mad. Yeah. You was going to stay at the uh, decoy's house as well, weren't you? What was you going to say to your partner? Sorry? What was you going to say to your partner while you were staying out? Brothers. So you told him you were staying at your brother's? Yeah. Have you got a computer in that at your house? Is that the only technical device that you've got at your house? Yes. Does your Wi-Fi store your memory? I don't know. Do you know what this, do you know what this area shows me? I'm just going to say one yeah, thing about this, this area. This is a community. This is a community, this exactly is a right. Community people, here. Pe people really, really want to stand up to scumbags We like appreciate you. this, Wolverhampton. We really appreciate please, this. If, I'd advise everyone out there, whoever's close, please don't come. Said it loads we of times. cannot Get, if you weigh him in, we won't get a conviction that we want. Please, I'm imploring you all, please, just stay supportive, stay as a community, watch yourselves, watch your children against people like this. It's not even people, it's a scumbag. You can't be human. But please, please, but I can't say please enough. I can't say please enough. Oh, far too long. We don't know where the police are. They've been called three times now. Sorry? Uh, she's called them twice. What's going through your head when you see these people, right? What's going through your head? I thought you said he's scared. What's going through your head? Come on, let's hear it. I'm going to be calm. Tell me, tell me what's going through your head. You see, I can count one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, about 15 people. Well, what goes on through your head when you see these amount of people that come, want to come? And it, it takes me and my colleagues to weigh them away, call them off. Do you feel like a victim? Yeah. <laughs> mm hmm you feel like a victim. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I think if I was a victim, you disgusting person. A victim. A victim. Do you made a decoy 12 years old? Sent explicit um, porn to the child. Arts to lick his anus full anal sex said that he was going to stay over the decoy's house this is one of the most horrendous chats i have ever done was you watching is that where you come down Yeah, no, 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 that's what I'm saying. I'm sorry in his name, do you know what I mean? I'm really, really, really sorry. 
Police have been called David from when we first started speaking to you. Is that Poppers from home or did you buy it for this meeting? Home. Have you got any other drugs for you? Drugs on you that you were going to give to the child? Are you sure about that, David? Because the police are going to search you. You were, talk were you talking about ketamine in the chat as well? Sorry? Did you talk about ketamine in the chat? You, m you mentioned something ket and I couldn't understand what you were trying to say. I don't know whether you were talking about ketamine. No? No, Vicky's partner didn't know what he was up to. He said to his partner he was going to um, his brother's house. The poppers is in his um, pocket. Right, the police are in now, David. Just stay there and the police will come up. Do you want to speak to um, Andy? Go and talk to old Bill. There's a lady officer coming over now. Yeah, similar. What have you got to say for yourself? What if this had been a real child? What would you say to that child's parents? I don't really know. You don't know? There you go. That's it. You want to put your details in? Yeah, of course, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The camera's not on you, it's fine. That's oh, alright, um, good, good, good. Is there more units coming? Um, just me, well, me at the moment, but yeah. Fox Shot 2, I've got one under arrest. Um, I've got the details of the people, and um, they've got the printouts of uh, the email exchange. Um, don't mention on those details. No, that's what I should try to. Yeah. yeah, yeah. You've got an address as well. Mm -hmm. Was it yourself who made the call or is it you? Uh, I've the got a colleague back in London that made the call and then one of my colleagues here made the call as well. Thank you.
sharing and being supportive of what we do. Um, we do this for one reason, to get justice, and not let people like him groom children online. David Cox, Wolverhampton. Right, we're gonna go offline now.